back. CBS News Texas is in your corner, on your corner for the first time ever. The Volleyball Nations League Women's Finals are being held in America. The tournament brings the best players in the world right here to North Texas. USA is currently in second place, just one point behind Poland. And as your neighborhood reporter Caroline Vandergriff reports, it's a true homecoming for a few of the team's superstars. Week one was in Turkey. After playing matches around the world. Week two is in Brazil. Week three in Korea. Team USA is back on U.S. soil, preparing for the final rounds of the Volleyball Nations League tournament. We got a couple of days to rest and try to recover from the jet lag, and here we are. It's a rare opportunity for these women to play at the professional level in their home country. And I think for myself and for the other Texas girls, um, it's even more special that we get to host in our backyard. Gold medalist and UT grad Chiaka Obagu grew up in Capel, and teammate Asia O'Neill is from Southlake. Texas is a huge volleyball state, so I think this is a perfect place to have it. They're used to playing in front of sold out arenas internationally and hope fans here will pack UT Arlington's College Park Center. Having BNL here will hopefully open people's eyes and show them, okay, professional volleyball is extremely exciting and this is something that we definitely want to see more of and I really hope we can get to that level of all these other countries. Growing interest in the sport could inspire a new generation of players. I hope for the young girls who come out, they can see a possibility of continuing to play the sport that they love for a living. I definitely didn't know this was possible when I was a young player, so I just hope that that's what they take away from these games. As the top eight teams in the world battle to claim the number one title. The women are spectacular athletes and they do things that most ordinary humans can't. Come to watch the world's best. USA will take on Japan at 7.30 tonight in the quarterfinals. If they win, the team will move on to final rounds, which will also be held here at the College Park Center on July 16th and 17th. In Arlington, I'm Caroline Vandergriff, CBS News, Texas.